Hello, ladies and gentlemen, it's Wisman15, and welcome back to episode 6 of this Russian relocation campaign. Um, I have not been able to play this in a while, because I got so ahead with the first five that I was like, okay, this is going to be a while before I play again. And then the holidays came, and now I am here. Uh, Alright, so, we I, familiar, my, I familiarized myself with what was going on, just to make sure I knew where everything was, and what I was doing, and all the plans and such. I realized that we didn't have any siege equipment going to Genoa, so I built some there, and uh, we're probably going to have to fight this battle at uh, Palermo next turn. Are the Sicilians gone? I think they are. I can't remember, but I'm pretty sure they are. But then once we have that, we can pretty much unite Italy besides uh, Milan Genoa, which will shortly follow afterward. But look at all these Milanese armies we have to fight first. Oh yeah, that's going to be difficult. Ah, uh, here we are. We can win this fight, no problem. Yeah, <laughs> just a little bit of cav and other units. We can just uh, skirt around them with all our missile cav. Probably won't even take a casualty. <laughs> Come really far out first. That way we can just round them up. We don't want to back in and have them fall away. So what we're going to do is have these guys make, make up a line here. You guys are going to go far that way. And you guys far this way. Speed up because we don't want to wait six hours for them to come out. Okay. Good. We'll fight that unit. And we'll just wait a second as we take this entire unit down with a single volley. Hopefully. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, they're not dying quick enough. <laughs> we'll get you guys going that way, you guys going this way. We don't want to have anyone die fighting this cavalry unit, not at all. <laughs> it's just getting shot down to bits. <laughs> oh, I love it. Oops. Are you guys all good here? Yes. Keep managing our troops and such. Alright, now we can start going after others. You're just... Rain them with arrows, my men, please. I do beseech thou. This mailed knight unit won't last long. Is the general in this unit? No. Because they're fleeing and they didn't make any comment about that. Okay, we need to make sure they don't get us away. You're going to charge here. You can take out the peasants. That has a general, doesn't it? Yes, it does. So, of course, the weaker unit is fighting the general unit, but oh well. Italian militia, nothing bad, alright. Ooh, good charge. And why are you guys not attacking it? Uh, whatever. <laughs> Can we just have them all flee now? Just please, all flee. Haha, <laughs> general captured. Even though we don't really care about that general, it's just a captain. This unit is destroyed. What is not routing yet? Ah, these guys. Are they spearmen of some sort? Yes, they are. So we can't use our missile cap against them. This unit's just gonna... Oh, they were in skirmish mode. That's why they didn't go charge as I please, but now they will. But they are off the skirmish mode. <laughs> uh, I enjoy just shooting other things to bits. There we go. 13 men lost. That is not bad at all for a fortress, I believe it is. I'm going to sack it for all the monies. Yay! We have a fortress. Actually, we have two now, right? Yeah, because we got a fortress over here, too. So, first, we want to upgrade this one if we do anything to upgrade. Hmm. Let's see. We could get mines. That's not going to give us too much money. Let's see. Where else can we get mines? Nowhere else. But. Um. Hmm. 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 A barracks for Drusina and Drusina, which we already have. Oh, no, we don't have Drusina yet. So we'll get that. So we get this mount Drusina, which would be nice. Um. Yeah, we can get them over down here in time. 
We can have a Hulk too, and then actually have a navy that's worth a damn. Uh, let's make a small Orthodox chapel there for now. Okay, we can probably bring you up in tax rate, maybe get you a priest of some sort. No, priest limit is reached. Mm, Merchant's Wharf for money purposes. We need happiness over here, so we'll get them a town hall. Alliance, various units upgraded and gotten. Okay, so we're slowly capturing all of um, this area for our own devices. I think you might want to go take Tunis uh, that's down here. It might be nice to do so, so let's try to sneak our way down without getting sunk by all these ships that we are at war with. Um, maybe we get a Hulk and other things just to make our life a little bit safer. Ah, we don't have that much money in hindsight. But we will once we take uh, Genoa over here. Can we? We can't really combine. So we'll take this. Is it really that much in his favor? Oh, we have Grand Duke Vladimir. He would never lose a fight like this. Never! Ah, oh, my mouth's good. I have to work later today, so I'm dreading that. Alrighty, Roo. Here we go. Uh, what unit do we want to break it open? Of course the woodsmen, because they're so useless besides such trivial things as these, and rushing and forming meat shields and other things of that nature. Let's get this one unit there. We'll get all our crossbows in line back here. Ooh, we could use a siege tower. Yeah, that'd be nice. We'll just have the siege tower go somewhere like here. Okay, apparently I can't go over there. Um, <laughs> you were not allowed to go there. Maybe here? No. Why can't you go anywhere? Um, maybe here? Yes, yeah, so you can go here. Okay. And we'll just have some spearmen as backup. And that should be good. Get our cavalry, which we probably won't use here. Um, the excess spearmen that we have, which is pretty much all of them. Right there. And you guys just drop that because we're not going to be using it. Alright, that should be good. Oh, we forgot you guys. Oh, the, oh, we took the wrong ones. Damn. Here, we'll just walk these guys this way. They're not going to guard the walls. They're not going to guard these walls. I'm not even going to bother going to the siege tower over here. Oh, I'm being shot at. Run away. You're safe now. Ooh, they might actually flee. Now we sneak back and actually take the walls. Ha ha ha. Alright, we'll take that in no time. Let's just get... Yay, we've done well. Alright, slow down for one second. He's got his general way up there, so we're going to use the spearman for that. Get you guys all good. And maybe get these boyer sons to deal with the Genoese crossbow militia. Yes, that'll be good. Um, let's actually stop with this one and go with one unit of the spearmen, which we're going to hold back because I want these boyer sons to enter first. No! Alright, you spearmen can run back here. You guys, try not to die in the process of running away. Ah, uh, you're gonna die anyway. Mm, stop it! <laughs> I forbid death! Okay, these guys can just shut up these Genoese for just a short amount of time, which would be nice. In fact, we could probably just charge it with our general and be, faith, be safe. Not faith. Faith. Is that even a word? I doubt it. Um, don't you flee from me. Oh, let's hope this is a good charge with these axes. Come on. Come on, good charge. 
Nope, nope, that's lame. <laughs> okay. But hey, they actually got some kills. I'm proud of them. Alright, let's just get this unit coming in as well. You guys can start walking a long way. Oh, yes. Actually run the, ro the long way. He's actually bringing in his general here. So we might want to back ours away. Where is our actual general in this unit? Where fights he? Wow, he's a master. Oh, there he is. He's, I was like, he's a master of stealth. Hurry up, Spearman. We want to trap his general way back here. Yes, perfect. Uh, can you guys come up a little bit faster? Like, use your legs. Thank you. I don't want to pull this general out general, because I don't want him to retreat yet. So I have to wait. Um, as long as my actual general is safe from death. Because he's way in the back. Good guy, be coward and everything. I like it. Oh, here comes the enemy. Finally. But we will have them sandwiched. Which is good. You're tired already, but that that's fine by me. We'll get these spearmen inside. General. Oh, no, you snuck up to the front, you devil. <laughs> Alright, they're trapped now, so it doesn't matter. Let's just walk these guys for a second, save some energy. Perfect. There we go. Now they're trapped. We'll just use all these merchant guys here. Yeah, mercenary. Merchant, no. <laughs> I was like, merchant? No, they're mercenaries. Similar words, but you can't really confuse them too much. Perfect. You will be dead, whoever you are. Milanese guy. Mr. Milanese man. <laughs> this unit's actually doing a very good job of fighting off two units at once. <laughs> Especially while flanked. All right, how about you guys? You guys can go take out that other Genoese crossbow. Oh, damn. Run and catch up to them, please. Oh, it's the king! The king is dead. Oh, I like that. Well, that ex would explain why the unit is so massively large for a general's bodyguard unit. We got some fleeing, which is good. I, I enjoy some fleeing. Routers. I haven't played Medieval 2 in a while, I forgot all about lingo, routing opposed to fleeing, but you know, I got the idea. Okay, this unit should route soon. Where are you guys? Are you not catching up in time? Oh, they're getting away. You're supposed to flatten them. Flatten them. Okay, the uh, general's unit has capped capitulated and I've been using that word again <laughs> I don't know why it's always coming to mind now all right let's go here a little bit of speed oh good charge good charge maybe somewhat just make sure the general doesn't die that'd be awkward he's a little bloody but we'll do let's pull him out now You guys are tired as hell. Let's just get these guys in front. I don't want to have to lose you all. Okay. Apparently I'm still fighting over here. Cut them down. It's all good. It's all good. I doubt we'll lose the general, but I just want to be safe, you know? Here we go. This unit will do all the dirty work. Okay, this get, this battle's pretty much over, so after Genoa, you just take Milan, then Milan will be finished. Unless it has other units, and I'm um, not units, settlements elsewhere on the campaign map. But I don't think we have to worry about them then, because their main power horses are these two cities, which will be ours, rightfully so, because, you know, the Orthodox deserve Italy. 
particularly for the Orthodox. Voila! You're still not dead. Come on, die a little faster. <laughs> I'm asking kindly for a reason. You don't want to be rude when you take away someone's settlement. You uh, politely sack them and kill them. And take all their treasures and such and kill the children. What? Uh, <laughs> I'm not going to kill the children of Genoa. That would be cruel. I can't really specify what I kill, though. Execute. <laughs> Good Grand Duke. Okay, now we got tons more money. Just get those units recruited. I bet you he's gonna besiege me here, but we can beat that army. I'm more scared of this one. It seems pretty big with a lot of cavalry, so we need a lot of spearmen to counter it, perhaps. We also need, like, better armor for my troops. Let's see, what does he have? Does he have... Yeah, he's got burn, and also you can see just faintly, he definitely has Dijon. So he's got a few more settlements, so his power's not completely gone. Milan's power, the leader of Milan, whoever he may be, because I killed his father, or his brother, or whatever other royal connection he was. Are we still at war with him? No. We are still at war. We have no peace with anyone. Alright, we could go expand this way, but I think we want to unite Italy first and then maybe go for like a seaborne empire. That'd be fun. Ooh, we need to get an ally over here. Do we have any allies? No. We have a shit ton of enemies though. Jesus Christ. I don't even know what time I started recording this, so it could be a long time, it could be a short time, you may never know. All right, let's figure out what we want to do with the last bits of our money. This place that has yet to yield anything quite useful to my to my uh, campaign. We'll just start upgrading random shit. All right, that's good. We need troops, though. We ha we are building troops elsewhere, but maybe some archers. We don't have any good sources of archers. <laughs> Ooh, an assassin. I want him. And we can't get any more priests, so. But that's what we should build here is a chapel. Chapel? Chapel? Keep it on normal tax rate just so it has more population growth. And uh, then we will find. We will build an army or uh, combine an army to go take over Milan. So we'll go to the next turn. Oh, crap. Can't withdraw. Okay, you're not dead. That's a good thing. You're not dead. Milan? We just took one of your cities and you're asking me to be a vassal? Jeez, you guys are thick. As you besiege Chinoa with a pathetic army of yours. All right, we're going to take Milan next. Shouldn't be too difficult. Let's get our general out of this army. Because it won't be able to cross the sea. Let's go here. Just make sure we can slowly uh, create some sort of a navy. In fact... Yes, okay, they're side by side. They can just help each other out. Help each other out. Hmm. Let's just gang these guys together, get these archers here. And also these archers here. It's just so we have a bit of an archer force for this army. We can get peasant archers here, so that'll be fine, because we're gonna pull you guys in as well. And that. And we definitely need a priest, but that priest has to go down by Palermo to recruit the populace and make them all good orthodox young younglings for us. And that's perfect. We probably need more cavalry, but I don't think we can make any more. <laughs> uh, we'll recruit those guys. 
I don't care if they cost money. I want them. Got an assassin here. Could assassinate the diplomat. Let's assassinate him. Even though it doesn't really matter much. Just for some potential experience for him. Which it did give me. So he's a decent assassin. He's ready for a, a good future in assassinating people. And so will this guy. He's got two little eyeballs. I don't want to look at all this crap. Alright, can we... We don't... Oh, we can't be allies? Oh, cease fire, please. Trade rights? <laughs> Very demanding. You guys are so stubborn. <laughs> Alright, that is seems to be everything I can do this turn. Got no money! España, what do you want? España, please, just make a move, even though you didn't even exist at this point in time. Damn it. <laughs> Screw you, Venice. I have your former capital, but you have to let the... Oh, uh, now the Byzantines are on that army, that island, too. I feel like that island is a hot topic for enemies to take, and I don't know why. We have no control of these. Alright, let's go here. We'll prompt them to attack us by being in such a location. Just get these guys all to join up. And then we have a decent force waiting to strike. Right, that's good. We got no money, again. But we'll sack Milan, we'll have money. So, nothing much. Again, we'll just use our assassins for the turn. See what we can assassinate. Like, like this diplomat. Who is now dead? Good riddance. Maybe this rebel general in a turn or two. 39%, that one'd be good. <gasps> can we assassinate the Pope? Cardinal and the Pope. Pope is only 34% with this newbie assassin. Mm -hmm. Seems tempting enough to me. Okay, I, we really need to get all these priests and stuff out of this area, which would be more useful to my cause. Like that cardinal, that imperial priest. Do I have any more? The Pope, for example, who is still harassing me. Go to the next turn, we probably have to fight the Siege of Genoa and or Milan or both. Probably can only fit in one, so after one happens I'll probably cut the episode. Oh, the French want trade lights, why not? How about an alliance? Nope, you don't want that. <laughs> ah, this is the siege that we have to fight first. Shouldn't be too bad. I believe we can win this. As long as the <laughs> Byzantines aren't helping them. Oh great, it's all misty and foggy and crap. Alright, we're gonna get our these guys out instantly. Just have these guys hold down the gate and hopefully you guys will get some good shots off. What do we want to focus on? Probably all the cavalry slash infantry slash everything. Wait, you guys will go I'll just get out of the way before they can sneak in or something because we need the time to uh, harass them with our javelins this unit you need to separate so that I can keep you guys managed well oh turn on skirmish mode please skirmish them is that the general's unit? We can probably kill him. Yeah, that is general's unit. So we'll, we'll just make sure we take the time to make sure he dies. Okay, good, good. Ah, the problem is he's got so much infantry. He's not dying quick enough also. <laughs> Problem number two, he's not dying. I want you dead, Venice. Can't you see? Why do you have to make it so hard to kill you? 
If I only had more infantry, I think I could do this, but now I'm starting to doubt it. Don't have... <laughs> he's just got so many troops. What's it? He's down 20% of his troops so far, so that's at least some progress in the correct direction. You guys are so timid of approaching closer. The enemy's very much through our gates. Okay, we're gonna have to run in, stop with the skirmish mode, just be ready to fight them. <laughs> Gerald can't make up his mind if he wants to come into the fight or not. Quickly, maybe we can kill some of these guys. Yes, I, I know the enemy has taken them. What else would they do? Oh, we got a good angle with the crossbows now, which is fortunate. Oh, sort of. Ah, oh, he's dead! <laughs> that might actually be able to help us. Oh, please don't skirmish or fight those guys in the melee. You can't win that fight. I know you think you're strong, but you're not that strong. Alright, maybe we can route these guys, and that would cause maybe more to route. Alright, you guys are going to go on skirmish over here. Not going to engage those. You guys are going to have to go fight in the backs of these troops, because our <laughs> infantry line has completely disintegrated. Oh, crap. Don't do that. Alright, you guys are going to have to charge them. You're going to have to charge here. Okay, he's cavalry is routing, which is yes, yes, all of you route. That is what I want to see. Beautiful. Okay, we'll just take a few moments to make sure these routers can't come back and actually use our missile advantage against these armored surgeons over here. Oh, that's beautiful. Just watch them get run over. All right, this unit has to come here and javelin the hell out of these guys. Good, good. I like where this is going. <laughs> we need to get some infantry over here, but as of now, we actually have somewhat of progress going on. And these guys were out soon enough, and we'll capture them all and execute them. Yes. Continue, so they must all be dead. Or captured, which then they will soon be dead. Run in and route them. Well, they're already routing, but you know, you get the drift. <laughs> Capture the routers. It's got seven left, but seven too many. It should be all of them, right? Wow, these three spearmen actually lived through the entire fight. I'm proud of them. All right, we can't catch up to that unit, so exit battle. Yes. <laughs> We lost 42 men, pretty much all infantry. Execute them all. Oh, I can't leave you guys without this fight, so we'll do this. The battle for Milan has begun. Oh, God. <laughs> the odds are not in our favor, but we have to try. We can try and rush this army and just overcome it, but he's got so much infantry, but we've got so many, I mean, he's got so much cavalry, but we've got so much spearmen that we might be able to uh, overcome them with a good rush, because he also got, he also has those, uh, cat, like, to blow me up and set me on fire, and... Oh, and he got a hill. Alright. Let's get all our archers together. You want them on not this kind of arrow fire, but I like this hill that we have. Makes my life easy. Er, pretty much all spearmen besides one, which is fine. You guys have to. This missile cap will have to act as heavy cap probably for this fight. All right. Here's what we're gonna do. Rush that way, run. Get this line right in front. Get you guys going this way. And some of our cavalry just charging down. A valiantly, of course, charging. And probably focus all, all our fire on their cavalry. 
He's got some Genoese crossbow militia, but I'm not too concerned because he'll be on the melee soon enough. And hopefully he, we can eradicate this army before his reinforcement army comes. <laughs> that is the hope, at least. Okay, you guys have to go wide. Far wide. You guys have to go javelin those guys. You, oh god! Oh wow, you almost hit yourself, mate. Okay, pause for a second. Pause, pause. See, I can't do this in multiplayer, but I can definitely do it now, so I will. Give my time to actually give all the orders that I want to give before badder things happen. Batter. Batter, batter up. Um, you're going to have to go that way. He's got more cav going that way. You guys want to charge those mounted surgeons. You guys want to focus fire here. You guys want to focus fire there. And you want to focus fire there. Good. Okay, he's ganging up on that one unit of Boyer Sons, but it is a risk I'm willing to take, slash make. Because he's gonna gotta have some reinforcements soon enough. Let's get this troop moving. Ha, oh, we got a route by the surgeon, mounted surgeon cavalry over here. And we'll keep going. Just wrap around. Beat this. Oh, wow, they're just falling to bits. His entire left flank is already lost to him. His center is going to, which is good for me, but I just want to get rid of all those uh, catapults and such before they fire and actually do damage against me. Let's get our cavalry going around and just encompass their entire army as it runs away. What a quick battle. I wonder if old ba some old battles were this quick too, where they just started running away like cowards that quickly. Probably there's a few. There has to be at least one battle that followed such a order like this. Was it's just a pathetic display of a fight. I mean, that's pretty much how you won. You made the enemy run away rather than killing them. It takes forever to kill someone with a sword. You have to hack away and shit. <laughs> Especially with a spear, you just got stab, 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 stab. Because you can't really stab them through the face too easily. They usually like to guard their face. Customarily, people like their faces. Alright, now we can stop the archer fire because we already have the victory. Just don't want to ruin our chances of having survivors ourselves. Okay, you guys can flank here and maybe route that unit. Take out the Genoese crossbow militia running there. Okay, this battle is won. At least this part of the battle is won. Are you guys succeeding in the victory? Yes. The routers are being captured. Good, good. Spearmen. Oh, the enemy general flees. Ha ha ha. Stupid Genoese crossbow militia just will keep on running away. Little cowards. Cowards. They are plural. That is how you English. Alright, we have to set up our army. What? Oh, he's got some cavalry over here. Alright, we're just gonna focus fire on them. Until they rout. Which they very well might, because they're already wavering. And there they go. Cowards. Second time routing. Now we have to form up our archers to get ready for this fight. Run around. Infantry. Can't really know who's fighting and who's not, but... This unit's tired anyway, so it's not really going to be much of a use in a fight. These Genoese are still holding their ground somehow. All right, infantry form up lines here. Yes, that'll be good. Frankish knights and you guys have to start coming this way. Oh no, sorry about if there's any weird cut around this area. My family members were coming around and neglected the fact that I was recording. Um, don't know if it picked it up. Well, actually, that'll be a good test to see. 
All right, um, we need to get a good charge on those guys, which we shall. How are they still not dead? This army over here. Still got some Genoese hanging about and such. This will be a good charge if you don't run away all the time. Good, we actually killed some. Well, like two. Okay. This army's pretty much defeated. So we can get our general coming over this way. And um, find out how to kill those Genoese. Ooh, here it comes. And also we have to f figure out how to kill the general. It's coming right this way. You're going to charge straight into my spearmen, which is fine by me. And just keep focusing fire down on these Italian spearmen. Charge the Genoese. You guys, there's some Genoese around here that are still harassing me. Don't know exactly where. There they are. We will take out care of them. Yes. General, you should be dead shortly. This unit's being eradicated by Archer Fire, which makes me quite pleased to see. Oh, we got a route here. Fun. <laughs> they can't even get themselves together with all these arrows going into them. Okay, that's one army already running. The other one finally completely decided to be cowards. We can make them all rout, which they are. Okay, continue this battle. Stop firing because we want to capture as many of these as we can, especially the enemy general, so we can execute him. Especially since this is the Milanese, uh, the force within Milan. <laughs> I was like, the Milanese force? Wait, this is all Milan. Um, at least. The actual s city of Milan's forces is what I'm trying to say. Is over here, so we don't want them to go coming back into the city and such. We want them all dead. First we have to kill that general though, or capture him at least. Oh, look at all the specks of green. What a nice victory. There he is, captured by our troops. Alright. Is that... It's pretty much the entire Mil Milanese army from Milan. And the rest of them I don't really care about. So... Oh, wrong button. Exit battle. Ho ho ho. Heroic victory. Lovely. Took a few casualties though. More than I anticipated. My cat is making loud noises now. Alright, execute. Oh, 11k. <gasps> we united Italy. I don't want him because he's not loyal enough. Yes. We united Italy at last. Alright, that's good. Now, I don't know where to go from here, but I think this is the end of the, the end of the episode. Thank you all for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next episode. Goodbye, my friends, and we'll figure out what to do with this 18k that we have. It's kind of excessive, but uh, we're still third financially still, so we'll see what we do. All right, thank you all for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you all next time. Goodbye, my friends.